So, hello. Uh, welcome to another Rambling Man video. And this is coming to you from a forest. Uh, I'm probably about five miles away from the Scottish town of Moffat by now. Um, uh, it's been a pretty glorious day most, most of the time. Uh, as you can see, it's gorgeous sunshine hitting me right now. Uh, well, I've had to counter out that with, with uh, sh heavy showers and the old bit of thunder as well. But anyway, I'm not here to talk about the weather. I thought I'd tell you a little bit about water. Look, water. Everyone needs it, even when it's been raining. And when you're walking, it's always very good, very wise to have a good supply of old H2O. Now, one of the things I was very aware of on this trip when I was planning it was that I probably couldn't carry two days worth of water as well as on my camping gear, food and all the other stuff. And if you're doing a multi-day hike, it's very true, you just can't carry enough, can't always carry enough water. So, what I've been doing is I've been trying out uh, this, this is uh, what's called a travel tap. Uh, and I've just filled it up with water from the, from the stream just down there. Um, of course, when you're taking stream water, or any water, then you need to usually purify it. Um, it's, you know, as one person said on a, on a website I read, you never know when there's a dead sheep lying up the road, no matter how pure the water. So, whenever I need water, I, I filter it out. This is a, the travel tap is a filter bottle, basically. It, it filters out all sorts of weird and wacky stuff. Uh, the manufacturers will claim it's even filter out anthrax, should you be worried about getting hold of that in the middle of the forest. Um, indeed, they have even say that once it's been through the filter in this bottle, uh, that the, the water is safe enough and pure enough to put straight in your eye, should you need to do that. Uh, they've also supplied these big lumps of plastic to aid situations in third world countries where clean drinking water is uh, not always available. So I think we can guess that they stand by their claims that this is very pure water. It has been tested, apparently, the uh, system, by about four different bodies for different chemical and you know, removal and all sorts of... So, and uh, I think on their website they proudly proclaim no one has died for using this product. Wow! What a claim. So, how does it work? Well, basically the travel tap is a big plastic bottle with a filter in it. You can just see the filter there. There's a, a, a top. Ooh. Uh, and you can drink straight out of the bottle. I've found that it tastes a bit weird if you do that. So what I prefer to do is filter it into another bottle and I've got a, a clear plastic bottle here to show you. Uh, as you see, this is water from the stream below. This is actually amazingly clear. Um, a lot of the water I've been uh, purifying has come from uh, slightly muddier travel sources. <coughs> and as such has been rather brown. Um, this is very hard to do while holding a camera and so on. But we, we put the... You can... It's still there. As well as taking it straight out of the bottle, which I found a bit slow, you can decant it into another bottle. So here it goes. Uh, you just squeeze. What you do is you squeeze, and the water comes trickling through. We should just be able to see, probably not very clearly, but you can see it. Uh, one of the problems is this is quite slow. It'll take about five minutes to, uh, to do uh, probably about half a litre or so and that means generally what I've, I've been doing when I've needed water is I've been waiting uh, to, to fill up and having a break outside a stream mm -hmm. and filtering there that way killing two, two birds with one stone uh, as you can see you just give it a squeeze and at some point it will sort of generally stop trickling or slow down trickling uh, in which case just releasing the bottle S 
helps get the air back in to force the, the water through. Um, like I say, it is slow. It will take at least five minutes to do one um, half litre of water. And if you drink anything like I do, then that is uh, a long wait to, to fill up. Uh, what I've been doing in the bovies a lot is, 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 is getting a, a three litre water carrier taking it to the stream and then people are sending half the evening let's go up and squeeze 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 so it is a bit frustrating but um i haven't bothered to uh, wait the whole thing but you do get some pretty good tasting water very good indeed